Hi everyone, this is Alex Nice speaking, and today I'm gonna do a review of Sigma Rin Kagami. Before we go over that, we're gonna go over the box. First of all, uh, there's the word Sigma here. Max, it's named by Max Factory X Masaki S. I don't know what's that. Here's her name in English and Japanese in Kagami. Product number 19. And here's Rin with a very cute pose, of course. And at the back, you can see lots of other cute poses. So here's some Japanese words I can't translate because I don't know Japanese. Right, Sigma, two side of the box. Right, Sigma on top of the box, so Rin again. Same thing at the bottom. And I'll just go with that. Now here's Rin with a very cute pose, just like the one on this side. But this one is bare, and this one's okay. <coughs> okay, now here's Rin. Uh, okay, let's click for the active wishes. The next active wishes is pretty good. Oh, I can see that. Okay, then down, up, left, right, to the back also. The other is pretty good, but the uh, the, uh, the, the scarf, something like that here, box, it's um, raising the hands high up in the air. It, it box it up. And you can't really move much of the hand, but it's all good though. It's easy to move. And hold on. And the left arm is pretty much the same thing. Uh, the elbow, actually, that's how I bring it. And she's carrying her microphone. Whoops. Which is really small. And uh, the microphone doesn't have a microphone stand other than like me too, you know. Yeah. Yeah, and it's almost like that. The leg articulation is pretty good, but she can't make her sit down like that. Hold on. She can't really make her sit down. See, it's not much though. You can make her body stand straight while she's sitting down. And, you know, for a knee, her articulation is very good. It's really good. Uh, the leg, I mean, the feet are not so good. You can only move it a little and you can't move it side to side. And there's also a little bit of waist articulation. And now she has yellow hair, yellow hair basically, you can see that, and like a headphone with a ribbon on top, and like a, <coughs> she has a yellow ribbon, and she's wearing like a school uniform except for her, her pants, that's so short, and at the side of feet you can see it has an electronic sound system, you can't really see it, you can't really read it either. And on the side you can see a hidden, hidden Mickey, Mickey. <coughs> now, now that we've done that, we'll go over the piece. Now inside the Pigma box, they only give you this, they only give you this plastic bag, which is airtight for you to keep the other pieces. And you can write the name of the character on this the white thing to write on. I already wrote it on my mind. Now, she only has two pieces, which is one on already on the head and one you know right extra and this is a normal looking face smiling a bit while looking forward she has green or blue eyes I'm not sure how to tell it now she has like ten ten hand ten hand piece now this is the right side this is the left side you got uh, a shape of the hand which is like saying to grab something a fist an L and a same thing is like trying to grab something like that. Trying to grab something, L, this, and the uh, fist is told to put the microphone in. Now in the future, I will be buying uh, her twin brother, which is Len Kargamin. Uh, no, this isn't the same thing. This, on the picture here, it, it isn't articulated. Uh, this, this thing is articulated, but they look the same. You can see Len with a tie, a uh, 
guitar, which is a combination of piano and guitar. Short pants, same 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 shoes. They're twins, but they're they're fret, fraternal twins. Yeah, that's how it comes. Let's know this thing costs two hundred ringgit, which is sixty one dollars. So this thing costs one hundred ringgit, which is like twenty dollars. So it's a big difference. Okay. No, Rin is actually not from an anime or manga, I think. This is from a computer software which lets you synthesize music. Yeah, synthesize music. I don't know why it synthesizes me. Because I'm an idiot. I just synthesize on YouTube. Now, she's 14 years old. Uh, same thing with Len. And, you know. Now, since this is just my, this is my first time buying a Figma, I'm gonna do some comparison to it with my favorite story uh bionicles so let's compare the box get away so these two boxes are yeah like the same height see same height the same uh wide width I don't know how to pronounce it I, don't, I just know it's spelled W I T H D something like that and same thing with the side. It's basically the same thing. Same thing. It's at first they show you like the name of a series, character, the back. <coughs> yeah, they show you more of the character, right? Some like that. They kind of like the same thing. Like I said earlier, this is the first time I did a review of anything, so I'm not really good at talking. So um, the size is uh, a whole lot different. See, yeah, Matilda is like, I don't know. Uh, so the height, uh, height is totally different. Matilda is like, I don't know. Uh, and I guess it's 18 centimeters, and Rin is. Uh, hold on. Yeah, 13.5 centimeters. So, how can this thing, which is smaller, cost twice as much as this thing? This thing costs 50 ringgit, which is uh, 14 US dollars. And this thing costs 20, 20 or 25 US dollars. But my guess is, you know, this thing is from Japan. It's the first ever, ever uh, thing I bought from Japan. Well, I didn't go to Japan, just imported. Yeah, it, and this thing costs from America, but I think America is farther away from Japan to Malaysia. Hold on. There's Malaysia there. I don't know why and and the purpose of me making this video is that YouTube doesn't have one so I'm just doing something for the community. Yeah. Okay, uh now it's time for me to play something completely random to Rin. Bitch, I love you. Yeah, that's random.